Yes, sir. What's up, Dusty? Today, however, very, very pleasant reading. 73 of the Midlands area, 72 of Garden City, 70 reported by Dodge State Liberal, 72 of the Midlands area, 72 of the Midlands area, 72 of the Midlands area. Cold start of the day keeps the mechanic away. Welcome back to another video, man. I'm gonna wait for Dusty to warm up because she's kind of loud on cold start. All right, guys. So in today's video, man, we're gonna be heading over to Dollar General just to go pick up some Gugon so I can install these bad boys. Um, I bought these envelopes off of Etsy, and uh, they're not really the best shape. I'm gonna put some pictures of how they look. Um, they were only like I think ninety dollars for both, so maybe that's why you know it wasn't the best quality. But still, I thought the quality would look better because in pictures on the on their on their on their SC page on the person SC page, they look amazing. And uh, seeing it on one person car, they look good. So I don't know why my quality is like this. I don't know if you guys could see. I'm trying to circle it, but like part of carbon fiber is uh car part of the weave of the carbon fiber is like gone. And then like look at that, the top of the emblem is like all warped. I know, I know it's like handmade and stuff like that, but they could have did a little bit better with how it came out. Like they could have like grinded it down and made it smoother or something. But the passenger, I mean the passenger, the rear one, that was the rear. This is the front. The front doesn't look that bad. The front actually looks better, but the front does have some scratches on it that I don't know what it is. Like I'm trying to see if I can show y'all, but there's some big old scratches on it. And I'm trying to figure out like. What did he, what did the person do to make it come out like that? But yeah, we're gonna be installing these on the car because the ones I have on the car beat to death. Uh, those need to get replaced anyway, so yeah. Let's get it started. All right, let's go get that. Tag secured, yes sir, yes sir. All right, man, let's get this going. So it's really simple to do this. Um, oh, I could probably show you guys what I was talking about with the emblems. How they're not the best quality, but you know, they still look good. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me see. Can you guys see the scratches? Let me wipe it off. Let me know down below if you got. Oh, yeah, y'all see the scratches. And this is how I got it. I even ceramic coated it, and it still looks like this. So, I don't know what to do. And that's on both of them. This one has little circles in it, like like i don't understand the process of making carbon fiber badges but i know that you're not supposed to see those circles but yeah man that's what happens when you buy from essie and uh it's a new person or not new person but a new brand trying to trying to become something higher and uh you're trying out their product so yeah i'm not gonna leave the link down in the description because i don't want you guys to get this because it isn't high quality and I like to promote high quality stuff. But you guys, if you guys really do want one of these sets, uh, just DM me on Instagram and I'll send you the link to it. But uh, I would recommend you going with, uh, I think, Aerospec or something like that. There's a lot of carbon fiber companies that make Honda badges. So yeah, just won't recommend you guys to go to this one. But yeah, like I was saying, it's a really easy process. This should just pop off, to be honest. Yep. Just like that garbage you guys can see the difference in it like this looks better than this so I might as well put this on the car and take off this piece of crap because look at that that is disgusting Ugh. now I already know for the back of the car it's gonna be hard to take this off because this is straight like this is directly on it so I am gonna have to use some type of line to rip it off but yeah, that, that that's not coming off. I need to get like a fishing line or some floss and uh pry it off.
Nah, so we're ready to put back the new emblem because cause this right here just look ugly by itself. Look at that. Ugh. So what you guys think? I don't know. I Obviously, I think it looks better than, than that. But I feel like it's just a little bit too big. And what's really, really annoying me? It's just the imperfections. Like that right there is going to bug the hell out of me. But definitely looks better than the old one. Let me know down below what you guys think of the new one. Do you guys like the new one or the old one? Obviously the old one is trash because it's old. But the new one is new because it's new. So basically what I'm trying to say is, do you guys like the Type R badges or do you guys like the carbon fiber badges? I didn't feel like spending $230 on some badges, so I bought the cheap ones for $80. Poor mistake on me because now I gotta deal with this. Um, I always buy some eBay rep Type R badges or I could just spend the $120 or $130 or I forgot how much Type R badges cost and just get the real ones and just call it a day. But uh, I'll let these sit on the car for a little bit. Maybe it grow on me. But I don't know. I just don't like. I don't. I like it, but then I don't like it. If the imperfections wasn't so bad, I'll probably like this more. But it's like it's throwing me off. But now let's go do the back. Hopefully the back uh, looks better than what the front looks like. I guarantee it doesn't because just the top of this looks terrible. But hey, man, it's definitely better than these. Way better than these. Like this just looks terrible. Not saying like the Type R badges are terrible, but this Type R badge is just terrible. What is this? Huh? This is whack! I can't get jiggy with this shit! Alright, let's get this back one off. Finally, after like five hours, I finally got all that 3M tape off. So now we can put on the new emblem and uh, compare it to the old one. Five minutes later. All right, you guys, so it's on. What you guys think? What you guys think? What you guys think? I personally just think it's way better than this. But if this was real and it didn't change color like this, this would be better than this. But it's doable for right now. I kind of like it, kind of don't. Maybe, maybe it just has to grow on me. But it's definitely way better looking than this crap. This crap right here needs to yeet. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the little cinematics. This is where I'm gonna end off the video. I know you guys seen that the headlights fogging, not fogging, but having condensation in it. I actually found this out yesterday night, and I think it's coming from right here. Because right here has like a little slit, and uh, I think it's, I think it's like, you know, taking, like, I don't know. I think it's just coming off. So uh, I'm gonna get some silicone and put it right here, and hopefully, stop this, stop this condensation in the headlight because I don't want my headlight to go out because of the conversation, but yeah. This is where I'm gonna end off the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below what you guys think about the emblems. And uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Follow your boy on Instagram at underscore got the soda. And boys out, peace.